What's up, everyone? Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com. You might see all these ketone products on the market, but they might not have the Go BHB logo on it, and that's a problem. It has something called 13 butendial in it, which isn't a ketone. It is something that gets converted in the liver to ketones. But why would you do that if you could just take straight ketones? That makes no sense to me. So I'm going to go over what these are. I'm going to go over the issues. And I'm going to go over what you should take. So the bottom line is most people have no idea that this ketone they're drinking could be toxic. I said toxic. You're not just wasting money. It could be damaging your liver. That's right. That's right. So these ketone promise, ketone supplements, they promise energy, mental clarity, fat loss. Some of them work. Well, the ones with go BHP work, but others total garbage. And 13 butendial is the worst offender. So here's the bottom line about 13 butendial. It's not a ketone. It's a synthetic alcohol compound that your liver converts into BHB. If you're lucky, if you're lucky, conversions, as we know with um, ALA converting into DHA and EPA, it's not the most efficient process, right? That's if you're lucky. And the conversion process can acidify your blood and stress your liver. So rodent studies, again, take it for what it's worth, show that high doses of 1,3-BDO or butendial lead to metabolic acidosis and liver damage. Um, even lower dosages probably don't raise BHB enough to be effective at all. So what's the payoff? Well, maybe you get a buzz. You see, you see some of these being sold as an alcohol alternative because, well, let's be real. It is basically a type of alcohol. It's closer to antifreeze than performance fuel. Like you're feeling your body, your liver's like, what the hell is this? Kind of like when you get drunk, it's toxicity. Your body's fighting off the alcohol. Same thing. Oh, and here's the, here's the bottom line. Like it doesn't taste good. Like with Go BHB, if you tried the Rev7 drink, Rev7energy.com, tastes delicious. You can flavor it. This is an alcohol. It's bitter. It doesn't taste good. So I don't care how much flavoring you dump on it has a bitter, oily, chemical aftertaste. So, you know, at, at least you're, you're, not getting, <laughs> you're not getting that great taste feedback from it. So let's talk about Go BHB. That is real beta-hydroxybutyrate. It's not a precursor. It's not processed by the liver. Your bodies utilize it immediately. It's backed by studies. It's safe for adults and kids. My kids take it all the time. They've replaced their energy drinks with it. No nausea, no dizziness, no BS. And this is backed by studies. 2021, Journal of the International Society of Sport Nutrition did this study. And there's 80 plus studies and more coming. So I can only, like you'll see me, if I do a review on a supplement, I won't back it. I won't put my name on it. Go BHP is something I give to my kids. I take myself. And I am insulted. I'm personally insulted by people who promote 13 butendial. This is not a good ingredient. This is not a safe ingredient. And why do people buy it? Well, because they sponsor a lot of athletes and they pay them. I would bet, I would bet good money that most of these influencers don't even take this product. It tastes bad. They don't get the results. But you look at what goes on with GoBHB and real beta uh, beta hydroxybutyrate, it, it, they're getting great results. It tastes good. And if you look at Rev7, what's crazy is you get young athletes getting great results on it, great health benefits. It's used in kidney health formulas. But you know what's crazy is you look at Mike Lindell, the MyPillow guy, right? His base is loving Rev7. They're loving it. You can read the reviews right there. They're right on the internet. His base is older. They're 50 plus, probably 60 plus, mostly female. Then you got someone like me, a professional bodybuilder. My kids, high-performing athletes, love it. Spans the market, but it does everything. It helps you sleep better. It jacks you up for workouts. It's crazy. Something you take in the evening that makes you so pumped to work out actually will help you sleep that night. Improved all markers of sleep out of the Japan study. So I might be saying a lot about this ingredient, but I think this is the next creatine. It is not even the next creatine. It is bigger than the next creatine. You take creatine, you sample creatine. They're like, how'd you like it? I didn't, I didn't feel anything. 
Well, trust me, bro. In seven days, you will gain five pounds. Okay. okay. Then I didn't gain five. BHP is something you drink it. You take five to 10 grams of this stuff. You're buzzing. You feel it. You feel it. It's not the one, three butin dial feeling it where your liver's like, stop. It's real mental and physical energy. It's the hater proof supplement. It absolutely is hater proof. What are you going to say about it? Oh, it gets me jittery. No. Oh, it gives me clean energy is a good thing. Oh, it, it's dang, no, no, no. It's actually healthy, improves all health markers, cholesterol, all that stuff. Oh, it, hater proof. Energy, better sleep, better health. That's BHP. Boy, do I love some BHPs. Anyway, guys, let me know your thought. Um, there's a lot of products on the market with it, but I, yeah, you know what? If you want to try the Rev 7, it's out there. It is so good. Um, I have a couple cases coming here. I have more cases coming here on Tuesday. I'm excited to have more of that because my kids are out there. Like, what do we do? Like, and, and here's the deal. Like, look, man, I love energy drinks. Not going to lie. Like, I'm good friends. With the, I love the guys at Ghost. I have, you see my Instagram. I've had, I have cases of D Ghost delivered to my house. But my kids are drinking two to three of these a day because that's what they do. <laughs> so nobody wakes up in the morning thinking, man, I should probably take more caffeine today. No, they're like, you know, I'm going to try and cut back on my caffeine intake. Imagine something that gave you energy of caffeine, but only health benefits and actually helped you sleep better. If you drink it past 4 p.m., it won't interrupt your sleep, but I'll actually help you sleep better. Let's go BHB. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, click on the notification bell, and remember, that is not a game.